Tram, how are you? This is where it's all going to be happening on Sunday night. It's a little quiet right now, but all week long, we're going to be bringing you updates from here at the stadium and all over town. Tonight, we're getting an inside look at how agencies from the FBI to your local fire department plan to keep you safe during this week's festivities. Team 12's Michael Doudna joins us live right now. He's outside the Super Bowl experience in downtown Phoenix with the details. Hey, Michael. Hey, Mark. Yeah, guys, there's going to be dozens of events all throughout the valley, which means there's going to need to be a lot of communication and coordination from first responders to make sure things go off as planned. So today we got to walk through on exactly what their plan is to make sure nothing slips through the cracks. From the WM Phoenix Open to the Super Bowl. It's all happening this week. We know that there's a spotlight on the city. We're feeling the tingles today. And for first responders throughout the valley, this is something they have worked more than a year to prepare for. It's a year's worth of work. It's a year's worth of planning and preparation and training and ordering and logistics. And at the center of it is the multi-agency coordination center. It's an opportunity for all of us to get together. 12 News got an inside look at the communication hub, where 43 agencies are in one room together to share information and stay on the same page. The Valley is a huge place with, with dozens of law enforcement and public safety uh, agencies. So how does this work? Well, it could be as simple as dealing with traffic conditions after a crash. Instead of one tweet from a dot you may see three or four from multiple agencies. Or if something goes really wrong, well, you would have all of the agencies right next to each other for a quicker response. This does is this allows law enforcement and this allows public safety, fire and others, EMS, to coordinate and be more nimble in our response to things. And to prevent the need from a major emergency response, agencies are already working together with specialists on standby for potential threats. Bomb techs, you know, cyber intrusions, I mean, you, you name it, we have uh, experts in those fields to be able to help as needed. So as the Super Bowl gets closer and the valley becomes filled with concerts and parties, first responders are waiting behind the scenes. Then we do it in the background so they don't have to worry about it. We don't want them to think about their safety. We want them to go have fun. And guys, as we've stressed with other stories, when it comes to security, you're pretty much going to see more of everything, more bomb techs, canines, more undercover officers. Chances are if there needs to be some sort of specialty, they'll probably have someone out here to deal with any potential issues. But for now, Mark, we'll send it back over to you.